really is nice and tranquil here. I really wish I could kill those butterflies. You don't have to worry about that. They're not worth it. If only you had a long bug net. Ew, that sounds like a game I don't want to see. Oh, you're an asshole. Why is everybody saying that to me? Oh God, Dreadnought's Colossal Cannons. This one's a hoot. What the fuck? What was the B for? I don't know. Anyway, welcome back everybody to more Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy. This is Ghost of J406. Yes. And well, we have more crap to explore. But first, there's a one up down here. We're continuing our way through the Dreadnought Galaxy and all of its challenges that it has to offer. I didn't want to come down here, in all honesty, but well, I came down here on instinct. I don't want to be down here anymore. Makes sense. Oh god, they even have these back. What the? F oh! Wow, I thought this was 2D exclusive. Nope. Ah, good old screw platforms. How we miss you. Not really. Oh, look at all the little baby dogs going for a walk. Ow! Why'd you think that was a good idea? I was just trying to hide. Ah! Oh god, there's a lot more of them! Ah! Don't let me die! Don't worry, you're safe now. Huh. Why are there so many, many dog houses? Makes you think somebody died here. What? I mean, come on. Why else would somebody need that many fucking dogs? Like, I miss my best friend or my family member. Let me get five, no, eight dogs to make up for them being gone for my life. That's really insensitive and inaccurate as well. Why would somebody get so many animals in general? to replace a lost loved one. To me, that just sounds stupid. And you just don't know the heart. I mean, I'm not doubting somebody thought that, but you know, it, why? Why that many? Just get one. Just get one. There's no need to get more than that. Could you please just ignore me for a second? Yeah, sure. You need to get a hold of yourself. Come on. We're close to the end of this, all right? Look at this. There's so much fun going around. Everything's on fire. Explosive. It reminds me of the good old days. And things are dying left and right. It's my paradise here. Ow! At least they didn't kill me. Yeah, surprised you didn't get shocked by anything that happened to you. Oh, the upside down journeys are always fun. Aren't they? And nice to know those spike balls are able to stop the, uh, yeah, platforms. Aha! Like those skills? Huh, not bad. Could have been better, but not bad. Move, bitch! Now we're walking sideways. I feel a little uncomfortable here. Oh, come on, it's not that bad. Look, we can walk upside down again. Oh. I prefer to walk right side up if you wouldn't mind. Nope, no can do. Oh, fine. Be that way. Ow! Hey, you can jump on top of the cannonballs. Uh, yes? Don't you know how strong my legs are? I can jump on pretty much anything I want to. Yeah, except for fire. That's different. Have you tried jumping on fire? It's not easy. You make it sound as if you've done it. Ah. Oh yeah, Ice Mario. Aha, see? I knew you'd see things my way. Wait, did you do it on top of? Oh yeah, 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 that's right, it's right. That's right, when hot and cold collide. Ha ha. See, even you don't remember this game well anymore. It's been long, okay? It's been a long time for me. Going through this game in general. And well, ha! Huh, what a journey it's been. I've forgotten a few things because it's been a very stressful time in my life. Boo fucking who? Wow. 
What an asshole. I feel like I missed something. Maybe not. Oh, God, Revenge of the Top Man Tribe. Well, if you couldn't tell from the previous two stages already, they have a harder version of the Top Man boss, kind of. Anyway, let's go. Never mind, I didn't miss anything. I could go to the Top Man, but I see a warp pipe here. Check it out. It's trash picking time again. Oh, yes, this is the Rehash Galaxy. I forgot about that. You know, how is keeping a dreadnought clean? And so it comes and drops all the trash in the ammo depot. Hey, we have plenty of bombs. Maybe you can use them to blow up all this trash? Uh, a bit. Yeah, why not? Gee, thanks. This one's a lot harder than the first one. You need to get six damn good throws here. Throw as quickly as possible. You'll need to in order to freaking get through this hell. All right. All right, good. Okay. No! Oh god, I hope I have enough time. That was actually a really good run for me. Just make sure I don't miss that one. You're it too takes slow. bombs 10 seconds to explode. No, no, you gotta do it faster! There's always more, so come by and get later if you feel like helping. At least you don't lose a life from failing this. So thank goodness. Wanna blow up all this trash for me? I've been trying! So yeah. Pick up the first bomb fast. And fucking... Well, yeah. Pick up the first two fast, at least. The other ones, you can spend your time dawdling a little bit, but... Don't spend a lot of time dawdling. Oh, God. Yeah. Okay, that should do. Alright, I can win this. Oh, wow, I didn't even need that bomb. Jesus. I did some really good bomb throwing that time. At least I think so. Sweet! Wow, I'm never going to take out trash. Now I know you can just blow it up. Oh, take this is my thanks. I found a long route. Maybe it'll help you. About time we got a fast, easy star. Jesus Christ. I feel so happy. You want that trash to bits. Thanks. That's right. Remember, don't let the garbage people pick up your trash. Just set it all on fire and get rid of it. That way the environment can take care of it. Oh, uh, what? Global warming? Yeah. What, you can't burn trash? I mean, properly disposing of it is better than just burning it. Do you even know how trash is disposed of? Recycling? Oh, for the fuck you! Fine, I won't talk about it. Apparently you're against environmental issues. I'll keep that in mind, Mario. Jesus. Battle stations, purple coins. I figured this was coming up. So, yep. You got a second one of these. Just like with freaking Battle Rock. Now I gotta do the Dreadnought Battle Station. And, well, it's a little harder. Here's a tip, though. Try not to move off the center of these platforms. Pretty much all the coins are in a line. Ow! Just watch out for taking damage. Just try to take the time to realign yourself if you screw up. Avoid any cannon fire if you can. Good thing is I got some health already, so that's very helpful. Oh, yeah. And notice that the spin jump actually gets rid of your, um, uh... Horizontal movement if you were jumping from a moving platform. It pretty much stops you, your aerial movement, dead in its tracks. It's pretty rad. So, again, make good use of all Mario's techniques when you're going after the purple coins. Oh, God! Ah, oh, God! No coin left behind, please! I don't want to leave any coins behind. And just like with the uh, last one of Battle Rock, I believe if you miss one along the way, you can go to the Girmo who will let you go back to the beginning, I think. I've never actually missed coins on this, but I'd rather not test it out in case I'm wrong. Be like, oh, now you have to lose a life to start over and get all of them again. Be like, oh, fuck off. <laughs> there we go. Aha! Ow! Pay attention! Stop slacking off. Ow! 
Oh, you dick! Oh, stop it! Are you fucking kidding me? No! Oh, you dick! You got assaulted by like every cannonball you could at the end. Good lord, man! Oh, my head. I'm seething with anger. You don't sound it. Because I can regain my. I can retain my composure. I've learned from your mistakes. My mistakes? Sorry, let me rephrase that. I learned from being around you for so long to retain my, uh, true heartfelt emotions. Ow! No! I can't believe you. I can't believe you! How about you calm down for a second? You're the one racing through this level like it's freaking Black Friday! I mean... You know, now I think about it, these are platforms that move on their own. Exactly! You have no need to rush! I guess you're right. I'm sorry. Can we make up now? What kind of eyeliner are you going for? Okay, forget. Forget I said anything then. Now I remembered why we have problems. You act like we're in a freaking difficult relationship. It's hard to classify anything involving you in my life right now. You don't have to like me. Can we get off this topic, please? Just grab the purple coins for God's sake so we can get off this damn dreadnought galaxy hell. I don't know, I kind of like the battle station. I do too, but freaking... I don't want to be here for the rest of my life! Ah! What about my life? It's thrown away. Okay, for real, dude? You really gotta figure this shit out. But you're the one fucking up! I don't care. Figure it out! Jesus. What got up your asshole? Just go. Okay. So. You ever think about something like this as a kid? You know, like a horrible fortress? A defense? I used to think this is what the Fortress of Solitude was like. Oh, you're giving me the silent treatment now. I see how it is. Fine, I'll carry this show. It, it, so, uh, who has a Switch recently, huh? <laughs> Everybody enjoy that uh, Super Mario Odyssey game? Uh, come on, you knew it was gonna be great. I did. My adventures are always great. Come on, MJ, pack me up on this. You're really committed to this, aren't you? Fine, be that way. I'll get the purple coin so you can finally act up and start being matured about things for once. Whew. Okay, avoid the cannon fire. Avoid the cannon fire. Avoiding cannon fire. Oh, Jesus! No! No, 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 no! Ooh! Oof, I made it! Wasn't that a close one? Hey, there's a lot. There's a. Ow! There's a launch star here. What the fuck is that for? Aha! The last purple coin! Oh, thank God. About time you spoke up. Oh, I was so nervous. I just wanted to not say anything. You did it! Wow, you really worked for it. No fucking kidding! I don't ever want to see a ship like this again. Fair point. Oh. Man. That was a little annoying. Yeah. But we made it. So, let's just go finish the actual Top Man Tribe thing there. We gotta take them down for real now. And I really want to bring it to them hard and fast. Oh, yeah! God damn it. 
It's probably better if I did shut up. This wouldn't be much of a let's play, would it? It would just be a gameplay thing, which I'd feel to be a little boring. Some people prefer the silent types. You're using that to compliment yourself, aren't you? Maybe I am. God damn it. Well, we gotta do the same thing with the top men we've done in the past. Throw them into the electric gate. Now we actually have to kill them. I, of course, are gonna revisit this concept at some point. Thank you, Italian Grace. Look at you. Okay, I'm going to transform! Good, just get on with it already. Why can't they just immediately do it? Why do they have to make a show out of it? What a bunch of assholes. Seriously, what the hell? I don't need you! Check this out. I don't need you, bitch. Fine. I'll use you anyway, because I don't feel like getting it myself. Ha-ha! Kidding! Oh, it would be on the other side. Ah, I can't reach it! Got it! Ugh. Damn pole stars. Ooh, this section's a little fun. Oh, God. Pole star time. Be careful here. Hit a cannonball, you're going all the way back to the beginning of this section of this segment. So be patient and pick the best time to move out. Because otherwise you're getting nailed by a bunch of cannonballs. Trust me, that's not fun for anybody. What the hell? Yeah, you have to slingshot yourself to that one. You can't just hold and hope you get there. You gotta slingshot for that. Get away! Oh no, they have more freaking rocky wrenches around. Son of a bitch. Ow! What's in the treasure chest? I can't even open that. Yeah, that's funny. Why are they there? Ow! God! The super high technical space defense bullshit is really getting on my nerves. Bring it on! It's time for the revenge battle against Top Man. Let's do this. The arena looks the same as before, pretty much. And you have your blue luma right there if you need your extra life or extra health. So, the way this one works, he just does these Top Men right from the start. And you don't have the whole arena to shock him in. Instead, the walls you need to shock him with move. And that's it. That's the only difference. See, nothing has changed. Ow! Oh, yeah. He does have a quicker revival time. Getting out of that, basically. He can get out faster than he could in the previous fight. So he's a little bit harder, but again, it's freaking... Freaking Top Maniac. He's really not that hard. All you have to do is just beat the crap out of him. Just kick him against the wall a whole bunch, and eventually he'll go down. Oh, yeah. that was fun. Good, we're almost done with all this. I'm very happy. So let's keep this going, shall we? We're so close. Oh god, they threw in the Speedy Comet. I'm a little surprised they threw it in already. All right then. So what do you think it's gonna be for the Speedy Comet? In case you think it's that first mission, which would be a hell on Earth, it's not. It's a Top Man tribe. So, we have to do the entire level as well as the boss fight in a speedrun manner. This will be the last of the speedruns. How are you getting the most time for this one? Because this level can be a little crazy. You get six minutes. Oh, but look at that. Where'd the green top guy go? I don't know. He's hiding at the side there. But if you don't want to deal with that, triple jump your way up. <laughs> Come on, the hard way is for scrubs. Work smarter, not harder. As they always say. Well, sometimes working harder is the smarter way. That doesn't sound right. I said sometimes, not most of the time, just sometimes. Hurry up already, we're wasting time here. I will say though, six minutes is a lot of time for this. See, they made this level a little harder by throwing in more of the freaking red top guys. The red top men, rather. 
back off, you bitch! Oh, come on! Is it higher up now? Whatever. Let's go already! Let's hurry up and get out of here. Alright, one minute down. They probably reserve most of the time for you to get through this segment. Oh, and you can still get the extra health here, by the way, so... Don't worry. You can save yourself the trouble of having to deal with a whole bunch of bullcrap, like, you know... You know, getting hit here, like, three times and going out. Trust me, that's not fun for anybody. Well, either way, I made it through, no problem. Once you figure out the timing, it's very easy. You just gotta not rush it. If you rush it, you're gonna get hit by cannonballs a lot. And if you don't save yourself with pull stars fast enough, you go back to the beginning of that segment on the silver engine thing. I guess I'll call it a thruster. Either way, be smart with your movements. Seriously, what is with all these chests? You kill all the rocky wrenches, open them or something? I don't know. I don't care to find out. They're probably just star bits and coins. There might be an extra life in one of them. I don't really care to find out. I don't want to go too far into detail. Let's just go up and fight Top Maniac. So look at that. Why do I need six minutes? I've gotten up here in a little over two. Four and a half minutes probably would have been fine. And again, they are doing this for the casual crowd. Oh, you're going on that issue again. Why would you spin into him? I thought it'd be funny. You're an asshole. Don't forget, killing the red tops will get you coins, so... If you take some damage, definitely go after them. What the fuck?! Hey, we're finding glitches! Not necessarily a good thing, but that was certainly interesting. Yeah, what the fuck was that? I don't even want to know. I just saw a tornado of hell spinning there. Just spinning there. Yeah, pretty cool, right? No. Horrifying is more I like it. Jesus. Are we going to end this or something? Yeah, you're right. I probably should. Okay. Yeah, let's end this episode. So we finished off Dreadnought Galaxy. Got both of its comets. Come back next time. We'll go to the last main galaxy, which... Oh, boy. There's a lot to enjoy there. Is that sarcastic? Mostly yes. Oh, so it is kind of fun. It is, but in small doses.